In our journey today, let's explore Abba's life in comics. Hey, hey. So, in 1977, Abba came alive as comic characters. The Swedish newspaper Expressen released a comic strip series in 21 parts. Abba's story tells the story of Abba in comic strips. We see how Frida meets Benny, we witness Agneta's beginning and Björn and Benny's friendship, and of course, it also tells the story of Abba's music and their first songs and hits, and even the incredible first meeting of Frida and her long-lost father. This comic strip series was written by Peter Himmelstrand and illustrated by Swedish comic artist Kjell Ekeberg. He actually received a phone call from Peter Himmelstrand if he would be interested in collaborating with him. Peter Himmelstrand, who wrote these comic stories, had been very involved with the other members. He actually wrote songs together with Björn and Benny and songs for Frida. And he was working as a journalist for the Swedish newspaper Expressen. The comic strips were also published in Dutch language in 1978 as part of a strip album. Today, the first page of this comic strip story is part of the Museum of Modern Art in Stockholm. Wouldn't it be nice if they would re-release this series and sell it at the Voyage store in London or at the ABBA Museum in Stockholm so we could all enjoy it all over again or for the very first time. And this was only the beginning of ABBA's comic universe. Look inside Look In every week for the exclusive picture strip story of ABBA, only in Look In. Look In also for the six million dollar man, the incredible bionic woman, and the tomorrow people. And look in for a laugh with Benny Hill. Stewpot's up to the minute news desk plus fabulous color pop pinups. Look inside Look In every week and have a great time. Starting in March 1977 and running for one year until March 1978, the UK children's magazine Look In featured comic stories of ABBA in the magazine's famous picture strips. The cover of this magazine also featured paintings of artists and ABBA was frequently featured over the years. These paintings were done by Italian artist Arnaldo Puzzo, who also designed posters for movies in the 1960s. In 1978, the Swedish version of Mad Magazine also featured a comic strip with ABBA in hilarious style. And finally, in 1980, the official ABBA magazine printed several parts of a comic strip called ABBA the Story. It seems to me that these were reprints of the comic strip from the Look In magazine, but I'm not quite sure about that. One of the pages was also printed in 1994 for the booklet of ABBA's box set, Thank You for the Music. The official ABBA magazine was issued between 1977 and 1981. Did you read or collect any ABBA comics back in the day? What are your memories and thoughts about this? Let me know in the comments below. Today's episode was kind of a teaser for what is coming next. This will be part of a bigger exploration of the many incarnations of ABBA over the years drawings, cartoons, illustrations, Abba's universe. Alright, until then, hello! <laughs>